Greetings! This is the Hidden Object Guru, or as you probably know me better, Dixbev Vzdizverv. Wow, that was a that was a hard one to say. Anyway, uh, we're here to play The Clockwork Man, The Hidden World, Ultimate Edition. Don't know what the Ultimate Edition means. Hope to find out at some point. Maybe it has something to do with, I don't know, those gerbils? More likely this, free play mode. That's right, like the best hidden object game ever, uh, Campfire Legends The Babysitter, this game lets you replay hidden object screens once you finish the game. Now you might say, why doesn't every single hidden object game in the world offer you this option? And the answer is, ha, I have no idea. It's... It's obviously the best way to design a game. Anyway, here we go. Uh, we're playing the Clockwork Man, The Hidden World, because the last game we played was Clockwork Tales uh, of Glass and Ink, and that went really well, so we're looking for something with the same title, or a similar title, and so we, uh, we focused on this one. Hopefully, this is a good way to pick games. Ooh. I bet it does make for a richer story experience. Ooh. Life has a way of crashing upon us at the least expected moments, oh, threatening to smother all that we hold dear. My first treat to reality came when I was twelve. Treat to reality? What does that mean? Come now, Miranda, love, you mustn't cry. We'll be back before you know it. Oh my god, this little girl has a Clockwork Man sidekick. Besides, Grandpa what? and Sprocket will be here for you. You won't be alone. And his name is Sprocket! And he talks to her like he's our duty to or something. Alright, I'm already on board. Mother never kept her promise. As for Sprocket, he is still here for me. Eight years on. But what about Grandpa? Did Grandpa die or what happened there, guy? This game is so adorable. Really, they're not going to hold hands as they go into Spooky Mine? Oh, Sprocket. We are on our own now. <sighs> I guess Martha was too scared of the place. Maybe we can still find something if he has not removed all evidence. Oh, it's too dark around here, though. We're jumping right into the plot, aren't we? <laughs> also, and I can't stress this enough, uh, Sprocket's dialogue goes... Whoop doop boop deep boop. That makes me unbelievably happy. There's a tool near the water pump. Nice. Oh, so he'll give me hints. <gasps> That's so great. And crowbar. Ah, uh, the most important thing in the world. Uh, crowbars. Your task list keeps track of what you need to do in the story. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, okay. Where is it? Items you collect will be in your inventory to use them. Place a place it. I think you mean the cursor. Oh, to use an item. Play the item. Okay. You combine inventory and education resulting in common instruction and item. Okay. That all sounds great, so here's the checklist. Light the tunnel. Uh, interact. Uh, examine the area closer. Okay. Can do all of that. And journal says, okay. Arrived at the abandoned mines. This is the, this is the first page. Okay. The air is damp and stale. Almost suffocating. Ooh, Irish nowhere. Okay, so they are going to find her parents. And a coward named Martha flaked out. Yes, I'm aware of that. Maybe we use the oh, inventories at the top in this game. Now that is weird. Yeah, I didn't think so either. Okay. If I were a way to light the tunnel. Huh, we'll see about that. Consider yourself crowbarred. Nice. Oh, spooky tunnel full of bats. Oh, how do I zoom? Zo oh, okay, here we go. Yeah, that's not so much a zoomable s scene as it is m movement. I'm just, I'm just moving. Apparently, I clicked twice that time. Uh, I'm just gonna be hitting both areas. Great. There are four ways to move around. Yeah, I understand the concept of Novi. Oh. Not available in Mac. Nice. Up and down. Wow, that's too many ways to move around. 
You could just you could just do the standard arrow thing, guys. Okay. Hmm. All right. Uh, start the steam engine. We can do that. Uh, steam engine station at the beginning of a winding downward spiral. Walking them all the way down this track is not an option. Well, not a good option. She knows everything about steam. Water fuels some combustible substance and a way to light a fire. Okay. I kind of wish. Uh, okay. Uh, throttle. Gotcha. That's where the water goes, and that's where the fuel goes. I think. Yes. Alright. Um. Hmm. The furnace is empty. We'll have to look around for fuel. Beep boop boop beep boop boop. All right. We'll need to make some steam as well. Let's get to it. Well, that's what the fuel is for. It's for making steam. That's... Okay. Oh, alright, we're already doing this. So they can be in both. Oh, nice! Instead of uh, the hidden object thing, where the gold item means you have to do something here, it's just we actually know in advance which one we're trying to find for inventory. It's actually kind of neat. Okay. Okay, well, let's put the water in... Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Um, I just kind of wish... It. By the way, I like that she kept the crowbar. That's great. I feel like every character in a hidden object game ever should come to the hidden object area armed with a crowbar and a lighter. Like, just showing up with a crowbar and a lighter would would do a whole lot to save them a world of trouble. Uh, lumps of coal. There were a lot of lumps of coal right there. Uh, three more. What was that? Your journal keeps track of discoveries. Okay, that's great. What does that have to do with the thing I picked up? Nothing! So... Terrible time to, to tell me about that, isn't it? That was a crate. A uh, churn. You mean like a butter churn? Is that that? That was a leather case. Just looked like a regular box to me, but whatever. Watering can wrench. Uh, there's a hacksaw. Don't need it. Scales pale. I already found a pail separately from this. What is that? That was what a wrench used to look like. I had no idea. That's not the fuel I need. And this is a vessel with their case? Oh, pale. Again, I'm having trouble identifying some of this stuff, guys. So, you need a vessel. Which is different from a mug. Okay, what is a churn? Was that a churn? No, that was the vessel. Is that a specific name for that kind of uh, thing they put milk in? You know, that I think of as a milk can? I mean, no judgment here, guys, but I just... Uh, I'm not... What the? You're giving me hints at the weirdest time. Alright. Uh, progressive hint. Provides a hint. The hints are progressive. You get a nudge in the right direction. Not the full solution. Okay. What's the second type? Ah. Ooh. Random hit an item. Nice. Those are both useful. And... Uh... Nice. Alright. We can do this. You just have to find matches. Are those them? Those were them! Yes! So now we just need leather case, scales, and a churn. Oh, and still three lumps of coal. Uh, this is not part of the search. Okay. So I still don't know what a churn would look like, because I had so much trouble with the vessel. I automatically think of a butter churn, and there's a butter churn. Okay. Leather case. Um, hmm that? No? It's... Ah, there we go. Regular attaché case. Now we just need scales and two more pieces of coal. I really thought that was coal. And uh, game, thank you for the lack of misclick penalties. I have a feeling I'm going to be doing a lot of misclicking. Uh, anybody see those scales? If you yell really loud, there's a slight chance I'll be able to hear you. No? Yeah, me neither. Uh, Alright, scales it is. Search away. 
Oh, I was looking for uh, the hanging scales, like from the Scales of Justice. Yes, we did. Now let's get some water. Come on! Uh, using the map. Your map shows locations you need to visit in order to progress the story. Hidden objects, puzzles to find, puzzles to solve, interactions to form. Nice. Oh, cool. I feel like it's going to be more awkward than anything else. Uh, okay, so I need an iron rod and a lantern. There's the lantern. Yes, I've already figured that part out. Oh, wow. You were really over-explaining this really not that complicated feature. Uh, two chairs. Candelabra. Two candelabras, sorry. Uh, great big wagon wheel. I need a quilt. A quilt, you say? Uh, is that a chair? No, that was a frog. Don't know how I mistook a chair for a frog, but... Yeah. This is one of those hidden object games where the, uh... A lot of the objects seems to have come out of, uh, stock image libraries, so it bears almost no resemblance to the art style of the, uh, area it's in. So, like, half the time you can just figure out what you need to click on entirely based on how different it looks than its surroundings. Now, even... That doesn't have to be a death sentence for a game, obviously, if a game is willing to completely clutter up the screen with random items that don't look like they fit, then it will be considerably harder to, uh... That was almost invisible, guys. Uh, find the item you're looking for, but of course, that is unprofessional in its own way? Seriously, I don't see a quilt. Didn't we see a quilt? Is that a quilt? No. I hate to use two hidden objects. Oh, right there in the corner. Sorry. Yeah, like, it seems like the developers knew that to a certain extent, so they were, like, putting stuff at the edge of frame in the hopes that uh, you would not notice. Wow, this thing takes forever to reload. I did an in... Oh my god. How is that supposed to be visible? I still can barely see it, even though it was pointed out to me. That is... That is not great. Uh, lacks a wick, but it still has some oil left. Thin iron bar. Nice. Alright, so back to the map. Back to the... Oh, there's something to do here. I wonder what that could be. Okay, so I fill this up with... Okay, I'm confused. Alright, so can I get the bucket back and just fill the water up here in a stream rather than in the abandoned mines? Oh, okay. I don't know why I didn't do that in the first place, rather than even trying with the, uh, the hand-cranked pump. Nice! You go all the way, sister. That's why I love you. Uh, anyway, I don't know why I did that, rather than trying to use a hand crank pump in the mines. It's very weird. Uh, okay. Seriously, who's putting a... A sinking a well down to the bottom of a water table in a mine. Seems strange, right? Uh, water tank is full. Coal has been cold. Fire has been lit. No. Oh, okay, well, you didn't tell me that. Uh, start the steam engine. Alright, so I have to find some oil. Let's see where the map thinks that oil might be. Apparently it thinks the oil might be here. That's not oil, that's not oil. I really thought that was oil. Uh, maybe in the... no? Machinery? Yeah, I'll take that clue now, my adorable buddy. Lacks a lever. A control panel. Like, I've had no option to click on anything here. What? You know what? Let's just keep going for it. Some are retracted to the extent through metal slots in the walls. If I can power the engine, I have to remove them. The cold, uh, there's a control panel of the storm. Third level seems to have been removed on purpose. Okay, well, I already fixed that, so... Thanks. Uh, remove the rail barriers the block way down. Be happy to. Okay. 
So I just had to hit all of them twice and that just worked? Whatevs. Not gonna stress about it, but that's... Doesn't really feel like a puzzle, per se. Okay. Ooh, her parents were scientists. That would explain why I have a, uh... Uh-oh. Hidden world. Are we going to Thule? Alright. Um, yeah. That should have been a show-don't-tell kind of moment. Uh, maybe I he actually hear the noise from outside rather than just being told I heard a noise from outside. Um, hmm. Still have no idea where oil might be. Apparently it is here. I just can't see it. No. No. Yeah, I know it won't work without... Oh! It's great, but I still haven't left the thing on. Oh. Alright. I'm a dummy. That's... There's no reason to pretend that I'm not a dummy. It's just... Steam engine our way down to the bottom of this tunnel. Look everywhere. The old man said she was coming here. Oh no. She's over there. Grandpa's alive and he betrayed us. Goons. Some some hired goons are out to get us. Oh, nice. A submersible. I mean, I, I assume. I don't think it's built like that to protect it from the rain. Ooh. Oh, we weren't already in Chapter 1. Okay, that's fine. What? Yeah, alright. I'm not going to fight you on this one. You know, when clockwork men existed. Oof. Professor Lyle, it's Miranda Calamy. Yes. What is it that I can do for you, young lady? I found this artifact two years ago in wow, South America. Wow, she is quite a traveler. Last week, a large piece of lava covering most of it came off. I was... Hmm. What me? The geological anomaly, obviously. Uh oh. Not very interesting, I'm afraid. Calamy, you said. Are you? He was my father's. I think he was interested in Ooh. such trinkets. But I... uh, if it will make you feel any better, I... that would be excellent. That's strange, Sprocket. I've looked all over my parents' work, and I don't recall seeing such a cylinder mentioned oh, before. Oh, she read that line wrong. But of course, we can trust him, Sprocket. He's a professor. That makes me so happy. I know. Let's go to my parents' house. Okay. It has been Nothing left untouched in the past eight years, apparently. It, I think we'll need it. He's a database? Advanced object database gadget. Nice. Okay, the object database is so you the visual representation of all of... Oh! Click on the gadget and click on the object in the list. Nice. So I can click on this, click on carrot, and it'll tell. See, that's handy. Nice work, guys. Uh, all right, two dolls. Dolly one, Dolly two. No, wait, that was an angel. Um, hmm. Top hat. No. Pen. Sorry, gun. No. Oh, slippers. Carrot. Cash box. Cash box. Hmm. That did seem really out of place. Three pair of shoes. We were at four, but we found one of them. Leatherman journal. Parents photo? No. Looking for that someplace logical. And there it was. I feel like it should have been a frame, but whatever. Clearly boots, but let's keep going. Perfume bottle. Yep. It's often seen that second dolly. Oh, there it is. Monkey lamp? Is that a monkey lamp? It is. Uh, carrot, cash box. Capped bottle. Capped bottle is a very strange way of saying something. Uh, hmm. Bottle with a cap on it. Well, there's a dragon. 
Amber dish. Uh, cash boss, cat bottle, carrot. Yes! Ooh. I will remember to check that out later. So I can't... Okay, you meant later. Gotcha. Okay, everything, for the most part in this room, I completely understand it being here. Why is there a carrot? And, seriously, what is a capped bottle? It's just strange. Um, hmm. There's a strange machine. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing any of this stuff, guy. Uh, amber dish. Let's find out what an amber dish looks like. Oh, okay. Well, then I did find that right away. Uh... I need to worry that they only show me what an item looks like because they realized that some of their stuff was unfairly oblique. What am I supposed to be clicking on? Yeah, this putting stuff so far at the edge of fra uh, frame that I can't tell what it is is not cool, guys. Um, hmm. Alright, I'm drawing a complete ba blank when it comes to the carrot. I don't see hide nor hair of this so-called carrot. Anybody? I guess 80% of it is covered by a table. I can't believe I have to wait for a puzzle thing to refill. That is not what I would call a thrilling way to spend my time game. I should... Oof. So you're literally forcing me to just sit here and wait for the puzzle. Uh, sorry, the hint button to refill. Why are you being so restrictive? Come on. Just just help me out here, game. Um, hmm. Seriously, I'm, I'm seeing nothing. And frankly, it would have been nice if you would let me... I mean, I already know what it looks... Oh! Jesus, crackers. See what I mean? Completely invisible. Oh, it looks like it. <laughs> it is such a lovely photograph. I'm gonna say it. People overdressed in the past. I know I'm not gonna have a lot of argument on that premise, but... Oh, that's the letter-bound journal. It's the one we found. It's kind of weird that... They don't already have, you know what, lots of entries in it. Uh, souvenir from the Coventry ruins fell to the floor last week. Oh, so new Coventry is somewhere in South America. Hmm. Okay. Uh, all right. That's sad. Let's go back and see the doctor, shall we? Nope. Let's pry open the floorboard, shall we? Okay. Scrolling scene. Of course it is. Uh, Alright. Coyote wand. What the hell does that mean? Yeah, I preferred the uh, screens in... Child's Shoes. Uh, at the Mounts of Madness, where they let me decide whether... I wanted to deal with this. That is obviously a vase. You see that? That says vase. This is a vase. Like, what did... You know what? Like I said, not gonna get angry. Just gonna go for it. I do prefer games where they, uh... That's also a vase, but... Don't tell me I hadn't found a vase. Uh, ooh. Okay. Dagger, fan, presumably oriental fan, because it's too early for uh, circular fans. Rotary fans? Rotating fans? Like, what's the right word there? Uh, Cupid, easel, mailbox, rat. 
I going mad or is that rack getting louder? Okay. I'll give them this. This is an extremely cluttered attic. Do I need the globe? No. Cupid! Ha ha! I still don't know what a coyote wand looks like slash is. So let's find out, shall we? Oh, it's a stick shaped like a dog. You know, game, you're treating that like it's a normal thing that a person could find in a place. That's complete nonsense. Especially if it's made out of real coyote, which... I would be against. Wait, no. Alright. What was that coyote wand? That's just so odd, right? Alright, um, hmm. Yeah, still don't need a dagger. Still don't see a mailbox or a cherub. Wait, did I see a cherub? No, wait, that was in the previous screen. Ah, there's the rat! Maybe he'll shut up now. Um, looking high, looking low, still not seeing... Nope, the... okay. Actually finding the rat has not quieted him down, that's... That's frustrating. Okay, easel. Be nice if I could collect that telescope so I don't have to look at it anymore. Broken mirror... That's a harp. Rosebud, obviously. High chair. Carpet. Whatever that is supposed to be. That was the cherub. Well, it was two angels sitting together, but whatever. Mailbox looks like that. Gotcha. Obviously, it can be much smaller, but at least we have a general shape profile. Oof. Okay, that one's a little embarrassing, but the game had kind of trained me not to look at uh, foreground images. So, I'm not going to take all the blame for that one. Yeah, I don't know how that uh, weird saw or clamp thing up here is hovering in midair, but that just doesn't look good, guys. Alright, so I thought Easel was going to be foreground after that whole foreground fiasco, but now I don't see it. I still don't see the hammer. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to need to use a clue, because this is getting quite infuriatizing. All right, let's let's let that fade away, and we can all just luxuriate in the fact that that is, you know, basically invisible. Just look like a stick, and the hammer part of the hammer, you know, the head that keeps it from just being a stick. The hammer part was effectively invisible. Yes, I'm well aware of how scrolling scenes work. I didn't ask. Do you think I don't understand how scrolling scenes work? This is my second scrolling scene. Alright. So it looks exactly like an easel, as I knew it would. Ugh. Damn you, game. Alright. Yes, it will surely come in handy. Okay. That's true. We can pry them open with a hammer. I would have preferred the crowbar we find later, but whatever. Oh, do we need to find a key? I'll need the key to open that beastly thing. Well, never mind for now. It's already getting late. We should probably leave it. For Crackle beep indeed. Oh! I did it. We have the third son. You don't say. Oh no! There I was thinking you deserved a bud. I told you I would find you did. Only it took you five soddy years. Worry not. 
You get your men ready. The hidden world awaits us. Oh no! Right. The nefarious right. Ransom and his men are going to the conquer Thule! Come on, Spocket. Let's go to the cemetery. Oh. It's so long. It's gonna be a downer. Mother always loved flowers, Spocket. Let's get. Okay. Um. So that's white daisies. These are crocuses, and these are lilies. Okay. I can find purple, white, and orange flowers without too much difficulty. I hope. Ah. Daisy. I want lilies, not daisies. Just occurred to me. There's more irises. Not finding the kind of crocuses I would hope. Okay. Ah! Nope. There we go. Daisy. Daisy. Iris. Crocus! Yes! So I've picked everybody else's flowers, pop them on the mother's grave. No, that says Antonio. Alberto. Austero? Oh. Wait, your parents are buried here? I thought they disappeared. Um. What? Hello, mother. Father. Okay. I. Hello. Oh, maybe she doesn't know that yet? This is a flashback. I thought... <gasps> Wait a minute. My father was born on the 6th. Oh. Time to rotate that 9. Nice. Okay. So I have to put... Something heart-shaped in there? And I don't have anything. Okay. Okay. Uh, Alright, so now I have to go find the... Uh, heart item! Heart-shaped object. Uh, Abacus, yes! Here's the bow saw I was talking about earlier. I swear I saw the camera like a bunch. Even clicked on it a few times. Uh, coconut dollhouse. Clearing stuff out earlier is really uh, gonna save me a bunch of time. Pepper grinder. Yes. That could not look more out of place, guys. Coconut. A flower basket. Flower basket? Yeah. Uh, hmm. Hourglass. Still no heart-shaped heart object. Glass iron. I know it was a stretch, but I thought it might have thought uh, a wrench was a kind of iron. That might be the definition of a stretch. All right. Okay, magnifying glass is small enough that it's probably going to be in the foreground boxes, right? No? Yeah, I guess that was wishful thinking. Um, Haha! Hourglass! Still looking for an iron. Uh, hmm. I really should call in an exterminator to deal with this rat situation. They're very loud. Still no heart-shaped objects. Ah, is that an iron? It is. Come on, coconut, and then we're out of here. Coconut. You can do it. You're brown and fuzzy shaped. I know fuzzy's in the shape, but... Ah, yes! Thank you. Heart-shaped object, please. Oh, there's a locket right there. Nice. Okay. 
Parents died. He's feeling like you have to wear it all the time. This is how you can see them in your dreams. Oh. Huh. Oh God. Damn, girl. That is that is rough. Uh, where were we? Yes, Kensile Green Cemetery. Okay. Yoink. Now let's get back to the uh let's get on back to the panel on the floor. The other cylinder Wait, I thought he said he had all four cylinders. They were. They needed a. Sorry, all three cylinders, hmm. but they needed a fourth Another one. Another one of these strange cylinders. Look, Rocket. How did she coincidentally Look, find one? Written by my parents. Was it on a planned Let's trip have a look. that her parents were going to do? The equations are too complex. Ooh. The paper with strange diagrams reports on expeditions to Ireland with L. Hmm. Where is that you hidden world? Right about the Professor Sprocket. Something shady is going on, and I mean to find Why out. Why does she think the Professor's up to something? Seems like a jump. Island Dock, hidden world. Oh. Maybe I'll have to use the symbols later. What's connection to Easter Island? That's what I would like to know. Sketch key by Laudimus. 500 Anno Domine. Okay. Mm. Okay. Line words. Like words. Wander is easy to pour and hard to recover. Save it for last. Oh, okay. So, wheel must be like the earth. Heart must be like fire? Sun, wind, and rain? Words, water. Oh, okay. Heart must be like the sun, fire. And winds of flame and praise. So, earth over wind. Um, hmm. Earth beats wind. Sun is beat by wind and water. Walk. You know what? I'm sure I'll figure this all out later. For now, let's just, uh... Ooh, Theseus. Nice. So that's the name of the submersible. Uh, okay, the button will change to new location when it's discovered. Great. Well, I wouldn't say new location, but whatever. Professor, it's Miranda Calamy again. I need to talk to you. Hmm. He's not here, Sprocket. Well, I'm not going in. Oh, no. Okay. Chisel, comb, compass. It's nice when we were first here that uh, you can tell by the amount of clutter that we're definitely coming back to do a hidden object search. Uh, do we see a saw or a shovel? Well, I see the shovel, but I didn't need it. Viking helmets, nice. It's one, two. There's the horsey. Viking helmet. This guy is really into Viking helmets. Three and fourth one's got to be right there. Nice. All right. So if I were a saw, ah, perfect. Old one too. Wildcat. Um. Hmm. Hope that's not like a euphemism of some kind. If there's actually a, a cat or a statue thereof, I around this room somewhere. Well, I'm not seeing it. So frog jug lantern. Oh, there's lantern, frog, and that is not a jug, that's not a jug, that's not a jug. That's a jug, yes. Comb, compass, saw. I thought I had the saw. What the hell was that thing? Anyway, it was a sword? Really? Alright. Uh, comb, compass, wildcat, saw. Is 
There's no close in area for me to zoom in on or okay. Oh, weird looking compass guys. Alright. Hmm. Okay. So not seeing anything that looks like a saw. No, I was about to say is the playing part of the violin called a comb, but of course it's not a call it's called a bow, so that's definitely not what I'm looking for. Let's uh let's find out what they want this to look like. Wildcat. Oh, okay, so it's a wildcat on a perch. See, this is what's frustrating me about this game. Like all this stuff is right at the edge of frame and crazily how is that a saw? Uh, what was I saying? Yes, uh, everything is on right on the edge of frame. And weirdly difficult to click on. Is that a comb? That's got to be a comb, right? No? Okay, tell me where the comb is. Oh. Hello, Johnny. Uh, for my things in a press office. Scrap some paper. Postcard, let's piece it back together. Okay. Alright. Going to need more numbers. Yep, that says to... I about was about to say it says to me Valentine. Because, again, I'm not great at the reading parts of things. Uh, okay, so I got one corner. And we got a serial number. Picture of lots of fleurs. Huh. Uh, that means you go here. Alright, got the other bottom corner, which... Okay, we don't really have yet. Let's see. Hmm. This goes up here? Yeah. Alright, we're almost done with this section of the box. Can we get the bottom section in there somewhere, guys? That uh, bird should go... yep. Okay, nice detail about this game. It's letting me... it's not like there's just one place on the map that I can assemble things. I can assemble them wherever, and they will all click together when they've been properly assembled. That is... It's not the usual, and it's very appreciated, guys. Okay. Yep. And it's allowing this ooh, me to get through this puzzle more quickly than I would have otherwise. Here? Yeah, here. And uh, right there. And here, and now the big one. Done and done. Three two six one nine. Huh. All right, journal. Let's figure this one out. What? O okay. That's weird. Okay, that's... Uh, let's try, I have noted them down correctly. I have. Monkey, and snake, and diamond, and skull. I don't know what that has to do with anything, but I've certainly noted them down correctly. Okay. So, I have to press six numbers, but I have twelve things in my inventory. Also, none of this information 
So cross, monkey. Oh, I didn't do Alice in Wonderland first. Uh, okay, let's clear a bunch of times with that. So, um, the answer would be Alice in Wonderland, Bible Origin Species. So that's rabbit, cross, monkey. Rabbit, cross, monkey, balloon. No, I hit monkey first again. God damn it. Give me a reset button game. Jesus crackers. Oh, there's the Iliad, so Trojan horse. This game is asking you to come in with a lot more information than normal. So, rabbit. Cross. Monkey. Uh, balloon. Musketeers. Iliad. We balloon. Musketeers have crossed swords, and then the Iliad. Now the next six items? Yeah, I know. Uh, Treasure Island, Moby Dick, the Raven. Alright, Treasure Island, which would be a, a boat. Pirates. Moby Dick. And what was the next one? Uh, we dick the Raven, Last of the Mohicans. So that would be the Raven uh, here. Last of the Mohegans, Tomahawk. I know. My god, I'm just bad at a puzzle. I don't need to be told what to do. Oh, crap. Treasure Island was the island, Hamlet was the skull. Damn it. Anthony and Cleop Cleopatra is... Oof. Actually, that's not immediately clear, is it? Oh, Asp, of course. Uh, King Solomon was mines that are full of diamonds, and the skull is Hamlet. Do I have to really do this whole thing again? Okay, but there are 12 items on the list. And those items are... Rabbit. Rabbit cross monkey. Oh. I'm a dummy. It's it's actually written here. So it's a... Uh, whale. Monkey. Cross. Alright. Yeah, I'm an idiot. Monkey. Cross. Uh, 619. Male monkey. Whale monkey cross. Trojan horse, rabbit, raven. I know you all got there before me, but please don't think of me as any less of a human. Folded paper, you say? Ooh. Professor Lyle, in light of the recent tragic events, the Departmental Board and the Royal Academy of Science have agreed to... One, withhold oh. all remaining funds pertaining to Project Hesperides, in which you are the principal investigator. Damn. Two, prohibit so they're canceling the project. Students to the laboratory Interesting. Magnetism. Three, prohibit any sort of field work within or outside of this country to you or your students. Your teaching responsibilities remain unaffected. On behalf of the board, Willem R. Price. Okay. See, that's a good clue. Hmm. The plot thickens, Sprocket. He was well, involved in the tragedy that fell the parents. Here, Island awaits us. Damn right it does. Alright, chapter two. Let's find that mine. Bally Scath, Ireland. Hmm. Hey, we're here! That's where the mine is. I will talk to the village residents. Oh, goodness. How can he possibly sleep with all that barking? I can't wake him up for the life of me. Maybe if I get the... No, Boop, bee, chirp. Nice. I noticed a farmhouse nearby. Perhaps we can... Okay. Aww. 
can't reach the mini scarecrow, and I'm not supposed to do anything here. Okay, farmhouse. I guess not... who might you be, oh. no parents. You youngsters all the time. Wow, she's the worst. I'm an imp expert. I'm... What? Nice. My name is Miranda, by the way, and this here is. Sure looks like an imp. Uh huh. Oh, imps. Now I'm just thinking about uh, Overlord. What a wonderful game that is. Um, voodoo doll. No. So, brush, frog, pocket knife, roller, rope, scales, telescope, travel, trumpet, tub, watering can, wooden cage. That all seems doable. Uh huh. Uh, watering can? No. Yeah, this foreground background nonsense is really annoying. Uh, okay. There's a brush. Squirrel! Aww. Oh, so that's what she's talking about. She doesn't like squirrels, which, again, seems crazy to me. Are they, are they really as loud as this game is suggesting? Has anyone ever been bothered by the squirrel munching on nuts? Okay. Yes, there's the roller for evening out land, I guess? Uh, telescope. No? Yes, telescope. Tub, watering can. There's the watering can. Tub, wooden crate, cage, trowel, and trumpet. I've seen that vase before. That's the exact same vase. And that's the type of scales I thought we were looking for earlier. Uh, is it going to be the same frog? Or we, uh, do we have to find a new frog? I'm fine either way, don't get me wrong. But yeah, I would just like to know in advance. New frog. Nope, same frog. Sorry. He just blends in wherever he's sitting. A uh, pocket knife, trowel, trumpet, tub, wooden cage. Is that a t No, that's not a tub in there. That's a tub. All right. Trowel, pocket knife, trumpet, wooden cage. That's a wooden... No, I really thought that was a wooden cage. Hmm. No, that's just a wicker chest. Wooden cage. All right, we're like literally almost there. It bothers me that that const that hunk of meat meat is constantly shaking as I move. There are enough like slabs of meat lying around that I feel like we're gonna have to come back here and look at it. Oof. Lock drawer, you say? Well, <laughs> we'll see about that. And this woman really should not keep so much, you know, cured meat just lying around her lawn. I feel like that's gonna attract animals. Trowel. Foreground trowel. Pocket knife trumpet. Come on, pocket knife trumpet. Uh, let's see. Yep, not seeing either one of those. So let's uh, get a look at what the trumpet looks like. So exactly like a trumpet is your answer. Thanks, game. That's hugely helpful. It's on its side! And ridiculously blended in. Now let's have the game tell us where the pocket knife is. Less blended in, but still super blended in. So yeah, lots of cheating is what I'm saying. Just a just a huge amount of cheating by this game. Alright. So, I've met Martha in the farmhouse. Squirrel problem. Blah, 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 blah. So for an imp and thinking that has come to steal property seems nice enough. Do 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 do. Risk catch squirrel trap and I just scavenge for the items I need. Yep. All right. So let's uh, trap this squirrel. I'll just place the cage on the grass and start setting up my. Ooh, right e oop. We'll need some so acorns. I have to go somewhere else for the acorns. Back to the stream! I just realized. 
No, okay, good. I was going to ask, are all the items I picked up earlier, that by which I mean later, uh, have they disappeared? And the answer is no, they're still there. At least the game thought that through. That was just a disc with a line on it. That is not a door knocker. Acorns. Do I not know what acorns look like? I oh, know they're there. Alright, bicycle chest. Screen. Alright, I need a pump. Hmm. Uh, it's just water. There's more acorns. No, get away. I want the acorns. Uh, acorn. Acorn? Yes. These are really, really finicky and hard to find. Bicycle. Did someone throw a bicycle in the river? That is not cool if you did that. Okay, net tangled down in the water. Some sort of figurine. A desk. Eagle statuette. No, that's a real bird. That was the pump. Which I think is some serious size cheating, but that's just me. Uh, hmm. There's the wheel. Compass again? Did I already find the compass here? Uh, the compass is probably somewhere else, but the point is, I definitely found a compass before and I was shocked by how it looked. Uh, one more acorn, people. And now I apparently no longer need them. Because it's not yellow anymore for some reason. Uh, acorn? Ah! Third cart. It's not a sign of the eagle statuette either. It's one of those things you move to the very edge of frame game. Yes! Got all the acorns! Without having to deal with this game's annoying habits. There's the compass! Way, way too big for a compass. So much size cheating game. Just, just so much. Uh, do you see a bicycle anywhere? Iris Eagle Statue Bicycle. Are Iris the purple flowers I've been finding over and over again? In that, uh, thing scene? Yes, they are. Alright. Tell me what a bicycle looks like, guys. Please. Oh, it's a penny farthing giant wheel bike. You'd think that would be more helpful, but it isn't. And then he immediately found it upon... What? It just looked like a you know, tangle of nothingness in there. Yeah, I, I can agree with that. Let's uh, go deal with the squirrel situation. Alright, trap! You've officially been baited. Oh, okay. Okay. Like what? A trumpet? Uh... What? Okay, so I need a stick and a string is what you're saying. Well, why haven't you created a hidden object screen for me to find the stick and the string? Oh, okay. Yeah, that was not immediately clear. Trumpet! What? Yeah, oh, nice. <laughs> Boy, <here. laughs> oh, see. Ireland. Excited. But, sure. Well, that was worthwhile. Okay, so I from a hangover, so I give him acorns? There really must be another way. Yeah, I still have no idea what to do about that miniature scarecrow. Or the adorable kitten. Hmm. Wow, that was weird. That's an upside-down head. Just a picture of an upside-down head sitting on this cobblestone tower thing. That's really weird, guys. Okay. Um, 
Yeah, the game is being super unclear. Yeah, Travis World talk to the village of It's great, but like, what are the steps I'm meant to be taking? Normally, when I need an item in a hidden object game, spoiler alert, you give me a hidden object screen and I find the items. But instead, my sole direction has been, you're not in the right place. Wait! Ugh. Oh. Okay. Yeah, randomly clicking to until I find a uh, hovering my mouse around the screen until I find some place to click is not what I would call stellar design. What? Are you kidding me? Is it for the dog? Thank you. That is pretty disgusting, but at least now I have the yarn. <laughs> Apparently I just got the cat to cut the yarn and... You know what? Whatever. This is all very random. Okay, fishing rod. No! That's true, I could. Alright. Back to the place where things happen. And string, and there, and acorns. Anytime you're ready, squirrely. There he goes. Whew! Have you seen these people? They visit now. Bring that floater. No need holding the photo like a celestial card. Of course, I remember them. But they used to go to and fro at yonder old mine. Oh, right? are you sure it was gone? Where are those marks? I may be old, but I certainly remember Hank. I understand. The place is cursed. I found a strange stone there once. Please. Is there no oh no! Well, you have been kind with me, and nobody's been nice to me for quite some time. <laughs> oh god, I have to collect all the food. Well, I did predict that. Uh, okay. It really was the. Do you seriously, honestly believe that uh, that chipmunk was gonna go nuts for all of the uh, prosciutto? Lying around your house. No. Okay, it's worse that I can't tell uh, prosciutto from like just salami and other dried cured meats. Uh, okay, I'm getting close, people. Oh no. I want to click on that bowl of strawberries. Not on... Forget it. Uh, so, sausage, vegetable... Four vegetables! Wow, I am really far behind here. Uh, there's another sausage. There's an antler from a from a moose. Which, I mean, if he's dead, it is... Like, the thing it's attached to might be meat. Uh, bread loaf. Prosciutto. Uh... Red loaf, yes. I don't know exactly what prosciutto looks like. I think of it as something that's sliced onto sandwiches, but they probably don't mean the slices here. They probably mean what it looks like pre-slicing. Also, I need three vegetables. And I don't know... Ah, pepper. Two vegetables... So many pots out here. So strange. Uh, two vegetables. Let's see what the prosciutto looks like. Okay, so it's like a leg of something. Mutton. Or pork. Are uh, those... Well, I was going to say those potatoes on the ground, but of course potatoes aren't vegetables, so... Hmm. Um, hmm. 
No. We're not. Ah! There we go. And tell me where the last one is, because I am tired of this screen. Yes! Cabbage! And off we go. Ashley's young listeners always complaining, never seeing the simple joys of life. Like having <laughs> other people do your housework. Yes, yes, I did. They'll keep me Patrick. Patrick. Oh no. Oh yes. I, I made this Charlie tea with glass tea sips. Took me years. Wow. Fine, fine. I'll try and get it. And then will we go? Yes, we will. Although no. I don't like that sprocket. She's oh, Pr Sprocket didn't want to weigh in with some more beep beep boop nonsense. Evil object, gotcha. Uh, okay, I'm gonna have that. She probably threw from a bridge. Should be worth trying to get. I agree. All right. Back to the village stream. Ah. Maybe that's where we'll use the fishing rod. Okay. Have some tea. That'll help you with your hangover. With it. Oh. Care to say who you are? Why you are waking me up? And what is that? What? Don't pay attention Aww. to me, Sprocket. I'm Miranda, and this is Sprocket. We are looking for information. You woke me up for that. Oh, might as well go back to sleep. Who cares about the mines? What junk? Oh. <laughs> I'm not one of those fancy university types. <laughs> and the people. Pipes and sheets of metal, you say? And you. Why was that? Well, oh. one day, old fella comes out of the vines wearing dirty clothes, dried blood all over them, full of wow. I sure did. Offered to take him to Cork to see a doctor. Yes. Oh. I think I can. Well, Mr. Patrick, I must go to those mines. Lady Martha has agreed to take me, but she needs... Lady Martha? <laughs> so you have met. Yes, she did. <sighs> she probably wants to burn it again. Oh. Ready? But, are you daft girl? As in marriage, as in, I was married to her. Technically, I still don't care about Ooh. it. Ooh. I can do that. Give me the fishing you rod and I will get to it. I do bottles. I just... But aren't those... Oh, no. You should clean up... No, don't go acting all motherly on me. Damn. This dude is the worst. How is that not a bottle? Okay, I was just clicking the wrong place. You know, that was more of a... Okay. Fireplace tools. No. No. Bottle, bottle. Bottle. Alright. See, that bordered on being a vase, but whatever. Hey, look, it's the creepy mannequin head. Bottle. Is that a bottle? Yes. No. Hmm. Axe, fireplace tools, seven bottles. How can there still be seven bottles on this screen? I have fireplace tools. On this screen, there are supposedly seven bottles and an axe. That seems like a stretch to me. 
probably more so because that's clearly a bottle and I can't click on it. That's so weird. Uh, hmm. Let's see what an axe looks like, shall we? So yeah, normal axe. Just a normal headsman's axe. And any normal person keeps her on their normal hangout. It is a nice doggy. Or is it? So we're still dealing with a bottle I can't click on, and a severe dearth of other bottles, and an axe. Oh, damn. Yeah, this stuff is, I think, borderline unfairly hidden. And by borderline, I mean very unfairly hidden. Alright, maybe that's not a bottle. Maybe it's a... I don't even know what else it could be, but it's obviously not going to let me click on it. So we have to move past our assumptions to find legit bottles. Uh, that seems to be a glass of some kind. Headsman's Axe! Yes! Come on, three bottles. Four bottles still! Oh my god! Come on, people. We can do this. Uh, what if they're green and floating in the air? Nope, brown and lying on a piece of wood. So maybe there's a gray one somewhere on this building? It's not a bottle down there. Yellow one in the... Now, that's a bottle. Yes! Yeah. Um, so if I have story one for my review of uh, Clockwork World, The Hidden Man, sorry, uh, <laughs> Clockwork Man, The Hidden World, it would be... Uh, you have seriously misjudged an appropriate challenge level for finding your hidden objects. Alright, so the last one's green. So I know it's going to be hidden in with something green. Is it in the tree? No. Ground? No. In there? Is that it? No. Seriously, there was one where you could see, like, a millimeter of the bottle. Alright, tell me where it was. Um, yeah, that's a lie. You're telling me it's that color in green, it's brown. The, what this thing looks like, is a lie. So now we have to go find a hook. Sometimes you make me angry, game. Does she have a hook? That's a no. That's true. Oh, I captured the squirrel? That's neat. Okay. Maybe. This, uh... Oh, wait. He wasn't in that location. He was in this location. Maybe you would be interested in a delicious squirrel. Okay, that was pretty funny, actually. Why would that not scare the crow away? Uh, okay. Let's see what the map tells me to do. Okay. The professor is bombed for my parents' death. Yikes. Uh, has he actually murdered them? Are their bodies inside the mines? And if yes, who is buried back in London? Good question. I didn't know anyone was. Uh, it's too deep for me to reach, but I have a stick. Oh, why do you need a hook to fish out up? A... Anyway, whatever. Uh, game. Okay, yeah, like, I'm just going to tell you, Hidden World, being asked to gradually 
Maybe you want a squirrel? Oh, shush. Ah, I can use the pole to grab the mini scarecrow. Yes! I knew I was going to be able to use that uh, fishing pole for two things. Farmhouse. Boo! I got a key! Uh, why did I need a key? Like, has there been something locked this whole time that I haven't had access to? Because I don't remember that. Checklist. Something valuable. Retrieve and turn Martha's charm. Fetch the evil object from the stream. Okay, so... Can I get the ring? So I give the ring... To Patrick. Patrick? Yes. Uh, charm to Martha... There we go. Here you are, Miss. I suppose. Who cares? So that's charm to me. Okay, Martha gets a charm. Mrs. Martha, take it, darling. And she does what? Oh, she's gonna lead me to the mine. Still don't have the hook, though. Fetch the evil object from the screen. stream. Happy to do it if you would tell me where there was a hook. No, really? Sorry, I shouldn't be that sarcastic. Oof, of course it needs recharging. Suppliers that I could use to... Or snippers that I could use to make a hook... Bird doll, lots of horseshoes, flowers in a basket. Yeah, I thought those were strawberries earlier. Um, hmm. Yes, locked drawer. Here we go. That took me long enough. Wow. Fishing hook. First thing. Three brooches. Brooch. That is a uh, half a lemon. Uh, brooch. Spurs. Corkscrew. Knife perfume bottle. Come on, knife and perfume bottle. Gloves, handbag, key, knife, perfume bottle. Gloves, handbag, key, knife. Is that a knife? It was. Uh, handbag, key, knife, perfume bottle. Perfume bottle. Scissors, three rings. One. Is that a ring? No. It's a thimble. Those are ear rings? Does that not count? Actually, they're bracelets. Oh, okay. Well, they're ring-shaped. So I call that a moral victory. Dentures? Is that a handbag? No. I'm not seeing gloves or a handbag, which, given the size of the items in this purse, should not be that difficult to come across. There's another ring. Uh huh. Yeah, that's a fan. Those are gloves. Okay. And the handbag is where? Let's find out what a handbag looks like, shall we? Wow, you'd think that would have been more help. Is that? Yeah, there it is. And the ring is. Oh, yeah. That one was that one was more fair, yeah. Whew. All right, fishing hook on fishing rod, and off we go. Still got a squirrel in my inventory, which is super weird. Uh, evil object. Yes. Five cylinders. We are doing this thing. Okay. Uh, let's check the phone while I mute the audio.
I found this cylinder in the stream. Was that what you threw away? Evil thing! Take it away! Fine, fine. So, are we ready to go then? I think we have everything we need. You bet we are. Let us be on our way. We're set, Sprocket. Let's see where this takes us. Look everywhere. The old man said she was coming here. She's over there! Okay, that was a thrilling set of cutscenes. You know, I know people like this weird structure where you do the... Ex oh, look, now the notes are in there. Parents' notes. Never checked those. Oh, we did. Um, I, I like that all of the new pages have been added. That's pretty cool. I should have checked whether they were numbered 29 and 30. Wait a minute, I videoed this entire thing. I can check whether they're 29 or 30. Anyway, uh... Yeah, uh, I find it kind of weird that we did that out of order. I think the intro with the dead parents and the mysterious objects are exciting enough. You don't have to start in the mine, guys. It's just weird. All right, so um, I think uh, we're an hour and 20 minutes into this, so let's take a break. Uh, I'm going to go do things and then come back to this later. But for you, all you have to do is uh, is wait for the video to end and the playlist... We'll, we'll start the next one, and it'll be like I didn't go anywhere, basically. Um, except if you did this not as part of the playlist, which you should have. It's just more convenient. But just clicked on the video somehow, somewhere. I think it's going to want to play the autoplay the next one, but uh, it's possible you don't have autoplay turned on, which, again, you should. So, see you back here. I've been the object guru. Let's uh, let's reteam back up for more of the hidden world where we take a submersible to Thule.